gonna be a good one. Uh oh. oh! I've made something for you, Will. Wow! Oh, thanks, Holly. You can keep your favourite marbles in it. Oh. Oh. I'm fine. And this one can be the first one in. Great. Big Bear, I'll see you and Rosie at the showground later. OK. Bye. This gives me an idea. I'm going to have a go at making something with clay too. Is my potter's wheel still in your shirt? Hmm. Found it at last. <gasps> Here we go. Hey, why isn't the wheel going round? All oh, the batteries must have run out. Oh. Not to worry. I've got an idea. Good luck. I'm off to play with Holly and Rosie at the showground. Up, 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 up. <laughs> Hi, Holly. I'm just charging these batteries up off the solar panels on the roof. Oh, I can't wait to use the potter's wheel. Ooh. Oh, uh, that might take a little while. The sun's just gone behind a cloud. I present to you Will's potter's wheel mark two. So how does it work? I took the clockwork bits out of this old robot. I haven't used it in years because its leg kept falling off. <laughs> like that. <laughs> anyway, I connected it to the wheel and I just need to wind it up. A bit more. Just a bit more. Whoa! Look out! <laughs> Sorry, Bluebird. <laughs> I'm never going to get this working, but I won't let it beat me. I've got another idea. I present to you Will's Potter's Wheel Mark Three. It doesn't need batteries or clockwork. Very impressive, Will. So, how does it work? Well, I pedal like this, and the Potter's Wheel spins round like this. Uh... Is anything going to fly off and hit me? Oh, definitely not. Oh, I'm going to have to pedal quite fast, though. Even faster. Yeah, oh, I'm getting hot. OK, uh, the clay, please, Raggles. <sighs> I'm fine. Sorry, Bluebird. No, I'm all out of ideas. So you won't be trying again? No. Yippee! I mean, I'm sorry, Will. <sighs> oh, maybe. Oh, no. Whew, it's nice to cool off. But what shall we do next? I don't know. Ha I'll get it. Whoops! <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> Go! <laughs> <laughs> hey, that gives me an idea for a game we could all play together. Here, you have the racket this time. <laughs> oh, this game is all muddled up, but it's nice and cool and great fun. I know. What should we call it? What about <laughs> Holly Ball? <laughs> yes, Holly Ball. <laughs> Here. I 
present to you Will's Potter's Wheel Mark IV. It doesn't need batteries or clockwork or someone to get hot pedalling it fast. So how does it work this time? By water power. <laughs> Taking any chances. Wow, Will, these are great. I know, and if it hadn't broken, I'd have never come up with this even better idea. And if we hadn't had our mix up, we'd never have invented Hollyball. And I wouldn't be the champion. Well, the champion definitely deserves a trophy. Here. Thank you. Hooray! Oh, I wish I had a pet, Will. All cuddly and sweet like this little kitten. <sighs> it is cute, but I'd prefer something more exciting, like a bearded dragon or a... A crocodile! You can't keep a crocodile as a pet. Imagine cuddling it with all those scales and big sharp teeth. Ugh! <laughs> Maybe I'll catch a crocodile at the pool with Big Bear. <laughs> Bye, Holly. <laughs> Bye! Oh, so small and fluffy. Oh. oh, there's nothing quite like the peace and quiet of fishing. Ah! <laughs> hey, puppy frog. Oh. Um. Ah! Hey, frog, you're scaring the fish. <laughs> Why, you cheeky thing. <laughs> I don't think there'll be many fish around here after that. Oh, we might as well head back. It followed me from the lake. I'll get it. Ew! It just licked my teddy. No, it didn't, Holly. Frogs just like sticking their tongues out. Disgusting. <laughs> get it, Will! I am trying, but I think it likes you. It licked my shoe. Please calm down, Holly. It's okay. It's not okay, Will. It's horrid, and I'm going. <laughs> the princess kissed the frog and poof, he turned into a handsome prince. And they lived happily ever after. Oh, so the princess actually kissed a frog. Oh. Come on, let's give the little froggy a chance and play another game. OK. Catch, Rosie! <laughs> catch, Big Bear! <laughs> a catch, Holly! Ah! <laughs> uh oh! <laughs> Oh, please, just go away. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> caramba! 
That's even better than my sleepy slidey jump. And my hop, skip, wibble, splat jump. Anyway, I've got to get back and uh, do something very important. That's right. Things to do, people to see. Bye. Oh, thanks for the advice. <laughs> Bully, <laughs> we're skipping again. Do you want to play? Not now Frog has gone. But I thought you didn't like it. I didn't at first, but now I miss him. And I didn't even get to say goodbye. Well, maybe you can. We can play skipping later. Come on. Look at him. He's so good at jumping. I would have loved to have him as a pet, even though he's not cuddly or cute. But I know this is where he really belongs. <laughs> well, you didn't turn into a prince, but I'm glad. I love you just as you are, my licky, sticky friend. Bye, Frog. <laughs> what game are we playing, Will? <laughs> it's called Hiders and Seekers. It's like hide and seek, but instead of one person searching, we split into teams. So it's me and Rosie against you and Archie. Yep. We'll be the Seekers and you can be the Hiders. We'll leave while you decide where to hide. The playground or the beaver dam? Hey, caramba! Hmm, I wonder. <laughs> Archie, you were listening to us, weren't you? That's how you and Will knew where we were hiding. Well, just a little bit, perhaps. Maybe. Right, well, you go and tell Will we're playing this game properly. Come on, Raggles. I've got an idea. Are we making sandcastles, Rosie? No, Raggles. We're going to play a little trick on Will and Archie. We'll use these flags instead of speaking. It's called using code. Hmm. Each coloured flag means a different place. Pink means hide at the playhouse, yellow means hide at Big Bears, and green means hide at Will and Holly's. So, instead of saying where we're going to hide, we show each other. Brilliant! Ready to play a proper game of hiders and seekers? This time, you go round the corner and count while we decide where to hide. With all the flag waving. They're using a code, like secret agents. Oh, cool. Found you. you. What? But how did you? We're the best code breakers in the world, Raggles. <laughs> That's how. <laughs> and now it's our turn to hide. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Found 
found you! Oh, how come you found us so quickly? Did you spy on us? Of course not. Hmm, okay. Well, now it's our turn to seek. And we'll find you even faster. What secret code shall we use next, Rosie? Hmm, how about hand signals? Hand up means hide at the orchard, finger on our nose means hide at the beaver dam, and waggling our fingers on our heads means hide at the showground. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty! <laughs> the showground! Come on! We are the best, amigo. No code can crack us. We're the code breakers! Whoa! <laughs> so, it's our turn to hide again. Come on, Archie. Hi, Rosie. Hi, Raggles. Did Will and Archie find you? I told them you were at my house. You told Ooh. them? Uh, yes. Uh, wasn't I supposed to? Never mind, Big Bear. It's fine. <laughs> That's all right, then. You know, the funniest thing, I just found my hosepipe and funnel behind a bush in the picnic area. <laughs> who would have been using those? I think I might know who, and I think it's about time we caught them out. <laughs> no sign of Will and Archie yet. I'm going to send out a scented code. They can't miss this one. Oh, it does smell like donuts. What if Raggles and Rosie aren't coming? Oh, and what if they really are donuts? <laughs> oh, oh, no! no! We did send out lots of codes to tell you there were donuts, and you did say you were the best code breakers in the world. <laughs> we saved you these, though. But you can only have them if you promise to play fair next time. <sighs> we will, we promise. Sorry, Rosie. Sorry, Raggles. Sorry, amigos. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>